How's it going, bros? It's your boy Stevie Ray coming to you live. You know where we're at. We're in the workshop. We got the laundry going. It's Sunday. We're gonna be doing another video today. Um, I got a request. I've actually been wanting to do this for a while. So we're gonna do another. We're gonna do another birdhouse. Uh, one of my friends uh, from work, she actually requested uh, for this birdhouse. So we're gonna make it, um, and I'm gonna go show you how to do it. So it's pretty easy. Every, everything's gonna be pretty straightforward. Then. We'll show you how it looks at the end. Don't forget to smash that like button. Hit that subscribe. Stevie Ray Adventures, baby. What, what?
house is the actual middle part. Okay, these two sides, these are for planters. So if you want to plant some plants, you know, put some dirt, put some whatever, roses or tulips or any type of flowers, you could actually do that. So I didn't, I'm not going to paint it. I'm going to go ahead and leave it the way it is. Um, maybe the person uh, who's going to get it, they can actually paint it themselves. You know, it's a match whatever they want. So it came out pretty good. It came out really good. I used a lot of nails. Um, you know, just kind of give it structure. It's all glued. So it's pretty good. And then what I made sure to do too was on the inside of the birdhouse, I glued all the surrounding area and I just like ran my finger around the corners to make sure that there was some type of barrier. Because if you do end up putting planters here, you put dirt, water, anything like that, uh, and there is a bird living in here, you don't want them to get wet in the bottom. So best thing to do too um, when you're making these kind of birdhouses is go ahead and drill pilot holes on the bottom of each side. So maybe like three, maybe three and then maybe three, just so that way water can drain um, if you're gonna have it outside. So I think I did want to point out. Um, I left a space in between both sides of the actual wall and the roof. So you can see it through here. You can see the other side. The reason I did that is because if you're like me, you live in Texas, it's, it's really hot. So if you do have this bad boy outside and it gets hot and there are some birds or you know whatever living in here, gonna get hot it's gonna get hot in here uh, so uh, just this is just so that way you know the air can escape uh, so don't don't entirely close it off and put vents on the top um, that and they're not I could barely put my fingers in there so that's just enough to let air escape so no like critters can go in and like snatch eggs or anything like that I mean I guess they can go through the front but hopefully mom was in there protecting them so yeah I just wanted to point that out real quick so yeah so this is pretty much how it looks so it came out really good. I'm really excited. So hopefully uh, my buddy from work will love it. 